welcome to my youtube channel nanjal biology here we are going to discuss about biology given the 11th and 12th standard syllabus now i am going to discuss about the first chapter given in the 12th standard reproduction in organism So here we have to know what is reproduction. So as everybody knows, this is a biological process. Process. to continue the life of a species so that the species never become extinct in this world so it is a very essential biological process so it is also fundamental features fundamental features of all living organism so what is the significance of this reproduction because of this reproduction life continues in this world life continues so continuation of the life takes place so all living organism have life here we have to discuss about life span what is a life span what is life span the period in between birth to death here all living organism from birth to death come across various events like growth development then a reproduction so the reproduction takes place in the life span of all living organism the life span varies depends upon the individual for example may fly may fly the life span is one day that is 24 hours the life span of may fly is one day the next the animal which have more life span tortoise roughly about 300 to 400 years parrot parrot the life span is about 1 50 years in plant kingdom banyan tree the life span is about 1500 years so see the various animals possess a different life span in all this life span they come across growth development reproduction finally death of the organism occurs and because of this reproduction their life is extended in this world otherwise the species will become extinct now we are going to study about some basic features 
in this uh, reproduction basic features so what are the basic things first one synthesis of dna so we know the dna determine the entire process of a living organism so synthesis of dna occurs then this dna replicate replication of dna so after synthesis and next replication then cell division cell division takes place and next growth takes place growth takes place then gametogenesis gametogenesis then fertilization finally new individual so these are the some basic features takes place in the process of reproduction so doubling of dna synthesis of dna replication of dna the dna replicates cell divides 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 and the number of cell increases results in growth and uh, gametogenesis gametes formation in the case of male male gamete in the case of female female gametes then fusion of those gametes fertilization and the new individual appears so another one important feature is death so after completion of this process the living organism attain death so this is about reproduction and some of the basic features of reproduction types of reproduction there are two types of reproduction we know they are first one asexual and second one sexual so now we are going to see the asexual mode of reproduction in it a sexual mode so here participation of one parents only one parent participate in this method of reproduction so that the young ones are genetically identical so so to get identical young ones so the cell division occurs by amitosis or mitosis the type of cell division takes place in this asexual type of reproduction is amitosis or mitosis so this method is called somatic reproduction this method is called somatic reproduction or 
ब्लास्टोजीनिक रिप्रोडक्शन ओके वाई एसेक्शुअल रिप्रोडक्शन इज कॉल्ड सोमैटिक रिप्रोडक्शन और ब्लास्टोजेनिक रिप्रोडक्शन सो हियर वी कैन गेट अ क्वेश्चन इन द नीट एक्साम हाउ assertion reason type like question assertion asexual reproduction is also known as blastogenic reproduction reason the reproduction takes place by mitotic or amitotic cell division so what will be the answer both assertion and the reason is true and the reason is the correct reason or explanation for the assertion like which question get be asked okay so next we are going to study about sexual reproduction sexual reproduction so with reference to this points only we can study the sexual reproduction here participation of one parent here participation of two parents who are they they are male and female participation of two parents and the next step we have to know here gametogenesis occur gametogenesis occurs so in the case of male spermatogenesis in the case of female oogenesis so because of two parents here gametogenesis so the case of male spermatogenesis and the case of female oogenesis occurs so what will be the next fertilization then development then new individual so due to this complex process variation is seen so that the young one produced by the process of sexual reproduction they are genetically non identical genetically non identical so this main reason is recombination of genes takes place during the process of gametogenesis and during the process of fertilization so the genetic makeup from the male and the female parents they are occupied by the newborn individual so they are genetically not identical to their parents and next we have to so this is 3 and the fourth one fourth one we have to see about cell division 
mitosis and meiosis division takes place mitosis and meiosis division takes place so that the recombination occurs during meiosis recombination the combination of the gene occurs during meiosis and the young ones are genetically not identical so let us revise so there are two types of reproduction asexual and sexual In the case of asexual reproduction participation of one parent the young ones are genetically identical and the cell division is a mitosis or mitosis and we know because of mitosis or a mitotic cell division they are also called as somatic reproduction or blastogenic reproduction in the case of sexual reproduction participation of two parents both male and female and the gametogenesis occurs formation of male gamete is spermatogenesis formation of female gamete is oogenesis and the fusion of gametes result the process is called fertilization and the development takes place formation of new individual with new genetic makeup that is due to the meiosis division takes place in the gametic cells so the detail of the asexual reproduction we can see it in the next video thank you